provision for children with additional learning needs is changing. How does this affect us at Marlborough Primary School? Most children's needs can be met by universal provision. This may include completing work set at their level in class by their teacher. Using resources available to all children to support their learning. Receiving additional support through an intervention to boost their learning in an area of weakness. Sometimes children may need a more personalised approach. If this is the case, the teacher will meet with the parents to come up with a personalised learning plan called a SMART plan. After the six weeks, it is reviewed by the teacher with the parents and pupil. The pupil may receive another six week SMART plan or no longer need a plan at all. The process can continue until the pupil's needs have been addressed. After two six-week plans, if a child is still struggling to make progress, they may need to be investigated to see if they have additional learning needs. Pupils with ALN will usually have a significantly greater difficulty in learning than the majority of others of the same age. A 35-day term time process will begin. The teacher will work with the Additional Learning Needs Coordinator, other professionals, the parents and the pupil to decide whether the child does have ALN. A person-centred meeting will be scheduled for week four where evidence will be assessed and a decision will be made whether a learner has ALN. If ALN are identified, an individual development plan will be written and the additional learning need provision will begin at the end of the 35 days. If ALN are not identified, then the pupil will continue with the six week SMART plans and parents will be directed on how best to support their child at home. A parent may appeal the decision with a local authority who have four weeks to respond. For further information, please read our website or visit the ALN section of the Welsh Government website.